Hi friends, I'm Alpha from Easy Approach and it's the 7th video of Flutter video series. In this video, I'm going to talk about one of the most important widgets that's used for layout purposing in Flutter. Suppose I want to show all the widgets uh, in the same fashion that you can see on the screen. I have five different widgets. All, all these widgets are tags widgets. And you can see the tags one is coming first and after, after tags one there's tags two and after that there's tags three, tags four and tags five. These all are in one column, you can imagine. If we want to show all these widgets in the same way that you can see on the screen on our application, so we can wrap all these tags widgets in a column widget. So there's a tag, there's a column widget that we so commonly use for layout purposing. If you want to show different widgets in a column, so we can wrap all these widgets in our column widget as a children. And now you can see all these widgets in one column that you can see now at here. And there's two more things related to this column widget that we need to understand. There's one thing that is called main axis. And for the column widget, a Y axis is actually the main axis of column widget. And there's also a cross axis. And for column widget, the cross axis is the I X axis actually. So this is so important for alignment purposes as well. So now we can go on the on the implementation part and we'll use column widget uh, and and in the column widget we'll define different tags uh, so that we can uh, we can see the same result so now let's move forward so now we'll implement the column widget in this application so in this application i have used an app bar a floating action button and there's a tags at the center of the screen is the application that we have already made now i want different tags to show in a column so what i'm gonna do i'm gonna cut this text and now at the child in the child i'm gonna pass here a column widget and now there's a very important uh, property which is children and you need to pass here all the children of column widget that you want to see uh, in the column so i'm gonna go here and paste the tags that i just cut so what i'm gonna do i'm gonna use here different text this is text two this tags three and you can have the number of uh, tags widget you want to show now you can see this uh, all these tags are coming here in the column so this is how you can uh, use column widget and if uh, you can also use different sort of widgets in the column widget not just the tags widget suppose i want also uh, uh to show here after tags three i want to show a button a flat button so what i can do i can use here a flat button and i can uh, pass here child property and the child property i can use the tags widget like we already did and in here you can pass anything like i'm gonna use login and i can change the color as well I'm going to define here on press for now it's just empty and all these children are separated by comma so don't don't forget to use this comma now I can refresh this app because I haven't defined here color so I cannot see this and we can change the color to red now if I refresh it you can see the button in between different widgets so this is how you can place your widget in in a column so if you want uh, to uh, show all these widgets in column you can use this column widget and it's so important uh, to uh, for layout purposing whenever we'll be making different screens playing with layouts we'll be using this column widget so many times so this is it from this video in the next video we'll learn about some more new widgets so if you haven't subscribed my channel please subscribe my channel and share the videos with those who want to learn flutter with easy approach thank you for watching